Welcome back. Well, if you want to reach your goal for 2016 of being healthier and you also want to check out some Tucson hotspots like the International Wildlife or the Arizona Sonora Desert Museums for free, we have just the way. Randy Asada is here to tell us about this year's running race season and the perks that come along with them. Randy, always great to have you back. Happy New Year. I haven't seen you in a few months. I know. Thanks for having me. Well, 2016, we're kicking it off. A lot of people are going to start gearing up for yep. the next races. Yep. Um, and I know one of them is the big race out at Old Tucson. This weekend, we have yep. a race. Uh, I would like to say it's big but we have about 500 people 600 people not like that June run where we yeah. had 3,000 people uh, but it's fun it's out at on the grounds of old Tucson studios we run through town and then out on the horse trails yeah. go over a place that I call horse poop alley <laughs> uh, so I think it's kind of fun yeah this sounds fun. I've done actually a couple 5Ks with Arizona runners. Is that right? Runners. Yeah. Excellent. But I always get a little bit intimidated because I'm not a hardcore runner. And and we see them out there. But is this right. kind of an event that anybody can go to any kind of level of runner? Yes. Good question. We have some speed demons out there. Uh, but it, uh, we have all ages and abilities. So some of the photos that were just flowing through, you could see all body types, all ages, uh, boys and girls. We have a one-mile family walk run, and that's designed for people who aren't uh, ready to go four miles through the trails. Mm -hmm. The kids dash. So yeah, everybody can do it. Great. Well, speaking of the kids, do we have something uh, costume related with them? Yes, it's called uh, uh, the Little, part little Partners. <laughs> <laughs> little Partners. Uh, kids dash. Yeah. And they could dress up or not as they wish, but we let them run uh, 200 yards or so through the High Chaparral set and the Bitter Creek set. Oh, wow. Uh, and we cheer for them and clap for them and yeah. Well, that's so fun. cool. Yeah, well, they love that. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Old yeah. Tucson is actually one of my family's favorite places to go and, and hang out and just have a cool day. So, yeah. But I have to say, it's like right in the middle of the desert. So on some of these desert trails, are you worried about wildlife, maybe rattlesnakes, anything like that? Yeah, people sign waivers, um, so that's good. <laughs> <laughs> but we actually moved it from March to January. And the reason we do it in January is cold weather, and we're hoping there's nothing out there. So, yeah, don't get bit by a snake. Don't yeah. put your hands down. If you see a mountain lion, run fast. Uh, <laughs> get, get ahead of the next person. Burn more calories. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. Yeah. That'll oh, get it's you a safe horse. There's cactus out there. There should be no wildlife. Uh, yeah. And it should be fine. Just be safe. Huh? It is a desert. So. Yeah. yeah. We, we live here. We, know, we know what comes along with that. <laughs> but, you know, I kind of gave a, or, you know, a little bit of a teaser at the beginning. We were talking about some of the hot spots you can yeah. go to right. for free because right. there's actually a lot of perks that come along with the races. Well, one of my commitments as people who watch this know is I'm trying to make Tucson better. Yeah. I, want, I like this city, but I think we could be a better city. Yeah. And we have cool stuff. And one of the cool things is the old Tucson Studios. Uh, I love cowboy movies, so it's kind of fun. <laughs> and then the International Wildlife Museum uh, on the other side of Speedway, the town side. It's kind of cool for kids. Uh, and then the Arizona Sonora Desert Museum is cool for everybody. Yeah. World class, world famous. Uh, and so we try to give a free entry. I think it's for this day only on Sunday, uh, the 24th. So, yeah. And then right. we have free breakfast. Trailside breakfast, we call it. Don't bury the lead, Randy. There's food Ooh. involved. You should have started <laughs> with that. Get food. Yeah. Don't get I bit by a rattlesnake and eat food. And I eat food. Those are the leads. Free I'll have food. to remember Listen, that. Randy, you do so many great things for our community. And, and one of the things I love is we're getting all these people out there to get more fit in the new year. It's such a wonderful event that it makes me wonder, do we have any more events yes. coming up that we can do? Uh, we have the Southern Arizona Roadrunners is our local nonprofit running club. And we put on about... 18 races a year uh, and we have a Valentine's Day uh, couples relay coming up over down at the U of A. We have a run in Marana, the Marana 5000 Sabino Canyon race. Uh, I put on a women's race called B Tucson sponsored by TMC up at Lawn Cantata. I'll be here in a couple weeks talking about that up at, uh, as I say, Lawn Cantata. Uh, yeah, we have a ton of races. Uh, our group is also affiliated with the free Meet Me at Maynard's and the free Meet Me at Lawn Cantata Wednesday and Monday free events in Tucson. Our goal is to make Tucson healthier, Southern Arizona healthier. So, yeah. And really yeah. quick, Randy, hit again the Gabe uh, Zimmerman Triple Crown. That's yeah. a good reminder. Um, uh, well, we have this three race series to commemorate and celebrate Gabe Zimmerman, who was murdered in the Gabby Gifford shooting, along with uh, others five years ago. And it's that Meet Me Downtown night run that we talked about, the TMC Saguaro National Park run, and the TMC Get Moving Tucson A Mountain Half Marathon. And we give medallions and t shirts. We had 800 people sign up for that three race series. The goal is to create fitness throughout the year yeah. uh, and celebrate Gabe. And we give funds to a number of resources, uh, charities, including child and family resources. 
Thank you for much. Wow, so many, so many great things going yeah. on. Randy, I'm so glad yeah. you joined us this morning to Thank kind of you. catch us up. And I'm going to yeah. make sure all the viewers have all the information this weekend as well. Excellent. We'll be Thank seeing you, you, I hope, uh, throughout 2016. Oh, so you know you will. <laughs> now, Sunrise at Old Tucson Trail Run will take place this upcoming Sunday, starting with registration at 6.45 a.m. You can also register the morning before at 3055 North Campbell. For more details, visit azroadrunners.org.